here on a dry day because we have been having so much rain that it has just been ridiculous. But, you know, Mother Nature was, she was working her magic because look at my dragon tail radishes. So this is what the package looks like. The, the radish, the dragon tail radish. Look at the flowers on them. And these are supposed to be the beans. So I like to come out here with my package and see if my plant looks exactly like the package or the picture. So let's see. Now it has the flowers. Look how beautiful these flowers are. Look at that. And those flowers look just like the flowers on this package. And now let's see if we can find some of these so-called dragon tail radishes and I'm looking at where the flowers used to be and I am thinking these are going to be the dragon tail radishes because they are just popping out and they're supposed to be super super long like these ones on the package so I am so excited because this is my first year growing these things and look at this one down here look at this radish right here it is long and huge. So, all right, I think I'm doing a great job because it looks just like the package and the pollinators are loving the flowers because before I came over here to start this video, they were like all over these flowers. So, I will keep you guys posted on this dragon tail radish because I am so excited about trying these because I have heard nothing but great things about them. See how the, the bees and the stuff are like all around it? Hey, that's a good sign. Means that they're doing their job and I am giving them food to sustain them and also to sustain me as well. So here are my radishes up close. Look at that. That is so amazing. And I love the purple coloring of them. That color is so neat. And the ones on the package look just like it. So woohoo! That's a win-win situation for Mr. Renee in Renee's garden. Loving, loving, loving this. So look how big. I had to put some um, steaks in them. I used some of those tomato steaks that you can buy at Lowe's in a pack. So I needed to support them because I didn't know. I thought they were going to grow like in a bush variety. But as you can see, nope, they are growing up high. So I might have to put a trellis on this particular plant. But hey. I will do what I need to do in order to help this grow and produce food for my family and my friends. So, okay, guys, I just wanted to bring you this um, first video on these dragon tail radishes. And if you guys have grown these radishes, let me know down below in my comment section and let me know what to expect, how they taste. You know, are are they, you know, are they gonna perform um, beautifully and just produce so many radishes that I just will not be able to stop eating? Give your girl the word because I am ecstatic about these. All right, guys, I hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you're having a blessed day, and let's take another up close look at these beautiful flowers of this dragon tail radish. Isn't that gorgeous? beautiful and I am so excited I can't believe that these radishes are so big look at this huge loving it and it's all the way here love it all right guys take care